Cela fait déjà un an qu'Alani nous fait languir, après 4 P aux couleurs des saisons encensées par la presse spécialisée et quelques concerts donnés en petit comité, l'artiste rencontre enfin le grand public grâce à la sortie de son premier album « You and I ». Né à Londres de parents originaires des Caraïbes, Alani a posé ses valises à Paris, qu'il a accueilli les oreilles grandes ouvertes. Nous avons eu le privilège de la rencontrer dans le tout nouveau restaurant du 18e arrondissement Le Co. When I was writing the songs, I I knew that the sound of the music and everything would really work in Paris, and I had no choice but to kind of move where my music was felt the best. I love performing in France. I love the audience. I love just the feel of walking down a street in Paris and just the le label parisien No Format aura été le premier à avoir le courage de miser sur son album délicieusement rétro qu'elle a entièrement produit seule. Pourtant, Alani a côtoyé les plus grands, elle a été la choriste de Marie J. Blige et de Damon Albarn qui l'a vivement encouragée à se lancer dans une carrière solo, ce qu'elle a fait. From such a young age, from the age of five, so from five till now, there's been many different stages of being artistic. I've done fashion designing, I've done, I've done marketing, I've, I've done yeah, like animation stuff. I did a film editing course. I think it was about all of these expressions clicking together. But um, music has always been my life from a very young age, so uh, it's it's been more about the progress of it than just like, ah, Eureka. But it did happen. <laughs> Whilst I was on holiday in Grenada, I found a moment of peace and I wrote Cherry Blossom and that was the start of everything. Have I been cursed to live alone this life I am waiting? Depuis toute petite, Alani a la musique dans le sang. Cela lui vient peut-être de son grand-oncle Hutch, une figure scandaleuse du musical des années 30. I take great inspiration and courage and uh, and a kind of guidance from having an uncle who who achieved what he did in in the time that he did, in the era, in the in the age that he did. Plus dans le dénuement, mais tout aussi captivante que son grand-oncle, Alani puis son inspiration dans le blues, le jazz et la comédie musicale de Broadway. Elle réveille les fantômes de Judy Garland, Bessie Smith et Billie Holiday. Son univers rétro n'est finalement pas si éloigné de celui de Lana Del Rey. I think what she's done uh, like with her videos, I love the concepts. Uh, the tones that she creates, the, the stories, and it's, it's modern and it's current, but it's also retro. We actually have the same stylist. He's a great visionary in being able to take uh, an artist and um, help them to facilitate and feel free to express themselves connected with their music. He's a good person to have around. His name's Johnny Blue Eyes, and he's a, he's a force and a great part of any musician's team because he's so encouraging and makes you look great. <laughs> Alani n'est pas une inconnue pour les férus de bonne musique, mais elle a tout pour devenir la révélation 2016 du grand public. Ses chansons, épurées et magnifiées par son interprétation pleine de nuances et son cesse-brouf, n'ont rien de contemporain, elles sont plus que cela universelles. Alors pour en savoir plus sur elle, nous l'avons soumise au traditionnel jeu de la boîte à questions. I love 
I love it. I watch it like it's chess. I like watching positions and formations and yeah, football. <laughs> Beach. <laughs> A horse and carriage. <laughs> be pretty cold with central heating inside, but um, yeah, I'd, I'd be a horse and carriage. <laughs> I'd be all close because I need them. <laughs> cheek to cheek, palm to palm, just as long as you keep it close, just as long.